Okay, um, the GED question of the day today asked, which point could be removed to make the following relationship a function? Just to let you know, this is kind of a weird little question. I've never seen this on any other test, these kind of problems, uh, besides the GED. But it's not hard. It's pretty simple. It's based on knowing what a function is. Now, remember that a function is a relationship where each input value, usually our input values are our x's, is mapped to one and only one output value. So each input has only one output, one y. Okay, so currently the relationship described in this table, this is a table, you can see we have some x values, we have some y values. So what I'm saying here is when, I, when x is negative 3, y is 1. When x is 2, y is 2, so on and so forth. And I can see that each input value here is mapped to one output value. But what you're going to notice here on this particular table is that I have a cheating x, as I call it. I have the same x a 2 seeing more than one y. In this case, when I had an input of 2, I had an output of 2, but in this case, when I had an input of 2, I had an output of 0. And that's what absolutely can't be. So currently, this relationship is not a function. If I want to force it to be a function, one of these points has got to be removed from the relationship. So it doesn't matter which one, you could take either one. So which point could be removed to make the following relationship a function? Well, you could take the point 2, 2. And notice how I write it if I want to talk about a point. I write it in parentheses. A point is always two, these two numbers in parentheses separated by a comma. So I could take away the point 2, 2, or I could take away the point 2, 0.